I do think as a society we are putting the cart before the horse if we talk about the technology and how it should de be deployed in schools as an automatic assumption. The marketing department of these companies are leading the uh, debate, not legislators, if we start from that assumption. To put it in its most simple and understandable way, the reason why we're having this debate is to ask the question, is it acceptable for us as a society to use a child's face as a proxy, purse or wallet, to pay for a bag of chips or a slice of pizza in a state school to solve a problem that doesn't exist?